Welcome to our Tech Explainer video. Today, we're tackling a common issue that many developers encounter when using Android Studio 3.0.0. One of our viewers has run into a, a frustrating error related to circular dependencies while trying to build their project. They were previously using a different setup that worked fine, but now they're stuck. Let's dive into the details and find out how to resolve this problem together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, I'll be going through your question, answering it, and hoping finding that solution that you're looking for. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy, just like me, and work through to that resolution. Now let's continue on. The error you're encountering is due to a circular dependency in your build tasks. This often happens when using data binding with Kotlin in Android Studio. First, let's address the CAP configuration. You mentioned you were previously using Android Processor. In Android Studio 3.0 and later, you should use CAPT instead. Next, ensure that you have applied the Kotlin CAPT plugin in your build Gradle file. This is crucial for data binding to work correctly. Finally, clean and rebuild your project to resolve any lingering issues. You can do this by selecting Build from the menu and then choosing Clean Project. After following these steps, your project should build successfully without the circular dependency error. If you still encounter issues, double check your dependencies and configurations. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To use data binding with Kotlin in Android Studio 3.0.0, you don't need to specify the CAPT compiler if you're using Kotlin Gradle plugin 1.3 or higher. Simply enable data binding in your build Gradle file by adding data binding enabled true or using build features data binding true. For more details, you can check the Jet by JetBrains issue tracker linked in the description. And that's it guys. I hope we found the solution you're looking for. And look, if we did, please hit the subscribe button. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time you need technical help, I hope you have a good one.